Yo, it's random. Before we begin, a moment of silence because another classic is getting rebooted. Thank you. Now, um, our Carly is probably gonna get worse. Now it's gonna get rebooted for another season. I think the ending for it, if I remember a, a bit, was pretty good. It did well, honestly. With Carly moving to with her father and everything and then and I can't even watch the show now knowing what Dan Schneider did. So yeah. But anyway, we're now gonna be watching this movie called I mean movie trailer called Hero Mode. I saw it before a few times and I gotta say it's pretty cringe, but honestly now that my memory like refreshed, I think it's better that I do it now. So yeah, let's watch it. Okay, and let's play. Is your game done? Already started a new one. I'm not surprised. My name's Troy Mayfield. I love making- Hi Troy, I don't like you already. Video games. My mom and dad started a gaming company, and all I've ever wanted to do is work there. Zack and Cody! That makes sense. Wait, this motherfucker doesn't even look anything like the coal spread or something. PixelCon is 20 days away. That's supposed to be like E3. I've literally never been more excited for a video game than I am for Exodus. Mark Ruffalo looking ass. The insights- Oh hey, it's my map pen. I saw a comment. I don't know if I can find it. That said, why does map pen look dead inside? That's because he is baby. YouTube Mama Susan's taking all his money away. And he's now a father. Imagine that. Scoop on Playfield's latest game. It is not good, friends. They ditched their game. They ditched their lead designer. Good luck. You're gonna need it. Same I was wondering you. if you might be interested in buying out your games. Yeah, I would do that for you. P.S. There would not be jobs here for any of your employees, of course. Damn, sir, why am I back? Well, let me come and help. I'm actually really good at mm, this. Sure you are, Kid okay, Hart. Wow, this is, look at the CGI. Everyone though. out there has been working weeks to try and fix those glitches that you managed to fix in one night. Um, but that's that on a chill. This is ba he's basically the modding community, honestly. Because the modern community can fix a bunch of bugs and have more free content than Bethesda ever will. But yeah, so he's apparently the Gary Sue of coding or some shit. That's why I am putting you in charge. Why are you putting a kid in charge? I got a little life hack for you, lady. If your team is so incompetent that some child can outperform them overnight, then you should just fire them and put a new staff. Controversial, maybe, but that's the real world, or at least what I've heard of. If you're incompetent, and if you're not friends with, and if you're not friends or family with with the boss, then you get fired and you get replaced that easily. Are you out of your? That, I think I saw him in Stranger Things. Mind? We are out of time. This is insane. Holy crap! It happened. This really happened. Cause loud equals funny. Of maybe dancing like somebody is watching. Have you ever thought that this movie won't jumpstart your career? I need some time to think and work on my you own. It's not even ray trace. Me down. This is the only job I've ever had. I helped build this company. I have my own family now. The longer we let Gandalf lead us, the greater chance is we're going to lose everything. It's not. It's a game. Like so far behind. I've never seen you ask for help. Uh, we need to find something that real gamers really want. Okay, here's what real gamers really want: a game that we can play multiple times and not get bored of. No microtransactions, and and no pay-to-win mechanics. That's all we want: no microtransactions. A game that is worth its weight in gold. That's all we want. It's not too much. Play. When I'm coding, I see a whole other world. And his love interest falls in love with him for whatever reason. What do you guys think you're reason. asking us? Yeah, we're all hey, Creed. Playfield Games, right? Let's show the world what we can do. Oh. I, for one, never doubted you. I doubted you 100 And speaking about doubting, I doubt this movie. I feel bad for Creed. Now that he's not in Scranton anymore, he's killing people, he now has to resort to this. Hiding in plain sight. Oh, and sorry for the mic. BRB. L O L. Just because you say it's cringe doesn't mean it's relatable. It's even cringier. Anyway, let's go to my favorite part the comment section. Okay, this movie is gonna bomb so hard. I am a game developer, and we totally write up perfect scripts in half a second. <laughs> 
Okay, Fulman uh, uh, looks like a scam. Thought for a second that the main kid might be a Dilly H. Ryan Reynolds. And any investment I had <laughs> went out the window with MatPat. Not sure if I should look out for film theory or game theory for this one. <laughs> I. S <laughs> Wait. Um, Sean Austin. I'm back in the shower again. Who the hell is that? Oh, okay. My Samwise has fallen. The Scott Rose online credits, I think, is pretty. I'm pretty sure he'll will be doing what Matt Pat did in this trailer. I'm only here for the um some Indian Island, but also the film looks amazing. Great job! I'm I'm excited to watch it. Am I the only person who's going to watch it for Scott the Wild? I don't know. Is that Creed? No, no, this movie is gonna be weird. Oh well, oh, in a day in a dog food company. <laughs> Hide your dearest children. It's like they age my pad long. Okay, this is gonna be the last comment since it's the longest. As a game developer, I feel like this movie is going to make me angry. Do you know what game developers see when they are coding? Code. Do you know what game the developers call glitches, bugs, or issues? I know most people m may not know this, but I, I, but the idea that they didn't have one developer profit from the script authentically is annoying. Quite frankly, I'm sure they could have found a developer today for free. This is a 13 year old views of the game industry. Having said all that, I love Sean Austin, so I guess I'm going to watch it anyway. It's kind of like me with Assassin's Creed Valhalla. Everything, including my mates, told me that it was going to be a shit game. I didn't listen to them. And guess what happened? Um, it was a shit game. Honestly, I had fun for a few hours, but, but why that matters? Just, I don't know why. But anyway, I did lay this video long enough. I was supposed to do this a week ago, but I decided to do it now since I'm home alone. But yeah, I guess that's about it. Uh, Hero mode is so kind of tank. And a cameo from Creed and MatPat is not going to help it. But yeah, that's about it. Like, share, follow, sub, and follow me on Twitter. And on TikTok. Yeah, that's right, I have a TikTok. And yeah, that's about it. See ya.